It's ya boy Warlow back with another my team video. And I'm gonna help y'all get literally this Andrew Wiggins card. So make sure to subscribe. I usually always say like <laughs> I forgot I'm on YouTube. But 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 we're gonna show y'all this. Okay, so I ended up completing it earlier. I dropped some gameplay. You know, I you know, you know, we did drop some gameplay, so make sure to check out that video as well. Rush, where is it? Rush, where is it? Yeah, Rush 4. So I'm gonna go over the best methods I think y'all should do for this, the best to make it easier for y'all. So first things first, let's look at the multiplayer challenges. I already know what's starting here. I already know, I already know, I already know. A lot of people gonna be like, oh my god, I can't be good online, which I agree. They they should have some offline challenges and stuff in that nature, but 2K don't like us, so we gotta we gotta do we gotta make it easier for us. Okay, so what you're gonna do if you suck online, you can use your best your regular squad. But if you want suck online, just run gold cards, okay? I, I suggest Charlie Ward, Anthony Morrow's really, really good as well. Where's Anthony Morrow? If you got him, he's really good. And then maybe put like gold. Gold bowl bowl. Gold bowl bowl. I mean, I'm just running gold bowl bowl. Bowl bowl's still really good. So bowl bowl. Oh, Oh, and let's see who we match up against. I used the Emerald one by mistake, but let's use Emerald Bowl Bowl right here. And we got three gold cards. Did I go in the right mode? I'm a straight idiot. Uh, okay, so he will end up quitting. But next up, you're going to come over to the Rush Agenda. So mine is down here. Rush 4, and you want to do the Double Doubles, Center Blots, and Hornets. And you want to try them at the same time. And I would show you on the player market who to buy because, I mean, there's no one to buy anyway on the player market. Like, anyways, and this card only like 15k, really, and it will help you a lot. And you can combine them at the same time, which I think it's worth. It. It'll save you a lot of time. Is you want to buy this center right here. You want to buy Omega Okafor, okay? Because he is a Hornet Amethyst center. And what you can do at the same time while you're getting these rebounds, right? You can get You can be doing blocks at the same time working on them too while you're at it you can grind the hornets rebounds 10 times and you can do the double doubles at the same exact time and you can quick sell them right afterwards once you're done with them you'll lose like 10k or 12k but that that's better and you can combine them so we're gonna go in it and i definitely suggest doing this on current it works on next gen too just next gen's a lot the cpu be acting iffy on next gen they be acting a little bit a little bit iffy on next gen. And you can get this game for free, I think, on current gen. I mean, Xbox is completely free. And PlayStation Plus is like... It's like, you gotta spend extra like $5. But, yeah. So, Oga 4, you're gonna hold LT. L1 if you're on PlayStation real quick. Hold Y. It doesn't matter. You can hold Y as much as you want on current gen. And then you're gonna jack up a shot. And, yeah, that's how you're gonna get your rebounds, though. So, you just keep doing this. Until you get 10 rebounds. And then you're going to get 10 points. And if you mess up a little bit. And don't do it correctly. Say you don't get your points. Then you can just worry about getting. You can get blocks on the other end. Easily. Like I said. Once you get your 10. Switch it over to Derek Lively. Because doing it with Emerald cards is a lot easier. So I'm going to so like look. If it's their ball. I'm going to show you. Let's see if it's their ball. Because once you get your 10 points, your 10 rebounds, then you can just worry about getting blocks. So let's like, let's try to, okay, uh, since we show y'all how to get, bro, really? Since we show y'all how to get the rebounds, let's try to show y'all how to get blocks. So I'm going to go into another possession real quick. I'm just going to run out of bounds real fast. And I'm going to show y'all how to get it. Let me just, let me just run out real quick. But tap into Mega Ogre 4, so RBX. Just hold A, X if you're on PlayStation. Then it'll switch the player. And then look at that. It'll switch them. I didn't get a block there. But usually you will get a block. You know, Matt Darius guard. I think he has Giant Slayer. You like that point guards that don't have Giant Slayer. So they don't just avoid your block. But hold A, X if you're on PlayStation. Look at that. And just move backwards a little bit sometimes. And look at that block. Look at that block. I just send them packing. I just send them packing acting really and to get points on the mega ogre for you probably can just score easily but you can do the same exact method lt old y on the mega ogre for get him stuck and then i messed that up a little bit i messed that up a little bit but you get it you will hold, you you will do it 
Okay, do it again. Let's do it again. Because I, I screwed it up a little bit, but it's all good. So L1, bro. L1, hold R, hold Y. Remember, you can hold Y as much as you want on current gen. And then look at that bucket. Easy bucket. So you get 10 points, 10 rebounds. And then you can worry about trying to get some blocks. Hold A again. And look at that. And that should get a block. Yep, I should get a block. And that's how you do those agendas. And like I said, switch it over to Emerald Derry Life. He's only 1600 and he's really good to get blocks with once you get your 12. So yeah, hope that helps a lot. Let's go into the next agendas. Okay, so this was a lineup I ended up using. I ended up doing this method with Austin Reeves and Clutch Time offline. But I'm going to show y'all like how to do it with a different player because maybe y'all don't have Austin Reeves. A lot of y'all didn't have time to grind them and you didn't grind me like Carlo. But I don't can't, I can't get Austin Reeves. You can buy this card right here, Sasha Vucevic. So Sasha Vucevic on the auction house is 1600 MT. You can literally use, and you can use them in place of Austin Reeves. And now I'm going to show y'all how to do it. Because he has bronze limitless range. So that's all you need. Both, as long as you don't have a lot of clutch time games and you're on a harder difficulty, which I'm assuming a lot of y'all haven't grind yet. And it is on pro difficulty too. This ain't even on semi-pro. And also another method as well. If you if you play less than five games, you can just keep losing under that. You know, so you will stay in that bracket so you can keep on semi-pro. That's also another method to keep. Okay, so what we're going to do is like since we're using Vucevic, you want to start the game off just popping a couple freeze ones. You could try to even get takeover with him first. Like just pop freeze like normally until you get like takeover to make it easier because you can't just do it like Austin Reeves you can just straight up just do the method I'm about to show y'all right away and he can do it from the get-go because he's a lot better badge but Vucevic sadly is not badge like that so you got to make it a little bit you got to do it a little bit harder a little bit you got you got to go a little bit you got to do it a little bit a different way so I'm gonna bang it let's bang a couple freeze we bang like two of them a little bit so Let's try to shoot. Let's try to let's even let's make one more at least. Let me hit one more with Vucevic real quick. Green bean. Then we're now we're gonna start going for four pointers because he's starting to get closer to takeover. I could just go all the way until I take go to takeover, but we're just gonna go for a four pointer right here. And it should work. Like all you remember, if all if you have used Austin Reeves, then you can just do this right away and it'll be easy. They'll let you open every time. So like, all you gonna do is uh, all you do is move your left stick. Okay, just move it back. Move it back a little bit farther and then pop that free pointer. And green beans. Look how easy then saw that green machine activated when I shot that free pointer with Sasha Viewers Vic. Because he has green machine and that badge does activate when you green it. When you green a shot multiple times, since that badge be working. So like good job with Views of Vic. And he's close to getting takeover, so I have to make how many free pointers? One more free pointer, and we should be enough, so. Let's do it again with Vucevic. Let's do it again. Walk back a little bit. Green beans. Green beans. Look at that green machine activates again. And look, he has takeover. All you gotta do is click your analog stick. Click your analog stick. It should be activating right now. Let's see. Is Vucevic activated yet? Why is it not activating? Hmm. I don't want okay, it's activating now. So all you gotta do, same method. Step back a little bit. And pop that free point. I think that's a free I just took. No, it's a four pointer. An easy method. Look at that. We got, I'm six for six. Haven't missed one four pointer yet. And we're hooping right now with Vucevic right now. And this is an easy method for y'all that are broke out there. And for, like, honestly, I showed y'all I make an Oka for We only spend like 17K in quick sell. I mean, it's only like maybe 11K. You're getting Andrew Wiggins at the end of it. So that's 100% worth it. And it's making it easier. So let's do it again. Vucevic right here. Let's do it again. Left stick. Shoot the ball. Green beans. Water. And that's easy. That's how you do it though. That's how we do it. Let's go back to the main menu real quick. But hopefully this helps y'all get Andrew Wiggins. I think this is the in the easiest ones to do. And especially with these methods. It should make it really, really easy. So you don't even need that much MT. You don't need Austin Reeves. You don't need high expensive cards and you get Wiggins which I showed the gameplay which Wiggins is still a top five shooting guard in my team so yeah see y'all in the next of my team video and keep